Hey, what is going on? This is Rob from Panther. Today I'm going to show you how to create this saw effect in Adobe After Effects. Of course, I got inspired from the masters again, from the best, and they also posted a tutorial, but unfortunately it, it was in Spanish. So these are the boys on Behance. I'm going to send you the link down in the description so you can access their work. So uh, the tutorial was in Spanish. Couldn't understand the word, but eventually I translated and managed to, you know, figure out how to do this trick. So let's do this. First thing, let's select the type tool, which is located up here. Click on it, click on the screen and select the color. I'm going to go with, uh, I don't know, let's go with blue. I'm going to, I can do the same thing. Okay. I can do this with blue, click on blue, select the font here. I'm going to go with monster red. It's a free typeface. You can download extra bold and type. I'm gonna press caps lock. So as you can see, I tried to scale it up, but it disappeared because the caps lock is activated. So I'm gonna press the ca caps lock again. There you go. All right, and now we're gonna go to the effects, click on the stort and go to the wave warp. So we got here the sin, click on the sawtooth. And now as you can see, it created this uh, interesting effect with lo which looks like a saw. We're gonna adjust the wave height to 20 and the wave width to 80 something like this as you can see it starts to you know rearrange itself and of course we're gonna go uh, the direction from 90 degrees to zero degrees okay so as you can see it's moving horizontally now just like that and from here we're gonna duplicate this uh, layer with the panther font so i'm gonna press ctrl c and then ctrl v as you copy paste normally so here it created a new copy the panther 2 so with the panther 2 we're gonna go to the wave height and click and enter minus 20. okay click enter and as you can see you're gonna create this effect and we're gonna recolor this and I'm gonna go here to recolor the recolor just just click on it and as you can see start to recolor it and click OK so this is how you achieve this effect so yeah this was it thanks for watching and if you're new on the channel don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get not notified with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos have a good day bye bye